Ruth here, and this is Shoutout Sunday number 89. I'm getting really getting along in these. How do you actually watch in these, though? Anyway, um, as usual, a huge thank you for those that have subscribed or commented recently, or consistently, or any time this month, last month, whatever. Anyway, um, so we've got, uh, Chew and River, user. ZR9TD1TE2P. Mm. Um, then uh, Edna LVAARAUJ057004. And Luca underscore battle. I hope I said those right. But uh, those are the ones that have commented this time, which is very nice. So, for the, I guess, next parts of the, um, those I've bought recently. There's Monozoshi Trading Card Series 2, pack opening part 3 to 6, was very kindly group ordered by Happy Bess. Or, it's Happy Bess on Instagram. I'll put both of the links in the description box below. The Modo Sushi Trunkland Bros pin was a collaboration between Peony Pinsco and Toriki Art. And then the MXTX Crepe Chibi Function pins was a collaboration between Shinzani and Peony Pinsco for a uh, a charity one, and all of these were very kindly group ordered by Bella Cookie. These bookmark molds were made by Melby Molds. Is it Melby Molds or Mel? Mo? Mo? I I don't know. I mean, yeah, we'll, we'll, link will be in the description box below. By the way, I have a link in the description box for ten percent off, as well as a ten percent off coupon if you want to use it. I bought these two trading cards when they really offered. And this is from Sleepy Snorlax X. These sugar car pins are foreign pins as the title suggests, so I don't know who made them. And I forgot if they said, but these were sold by Murmur Pin. Or it would be Murmur Pin. Murmur Crap. Well, I'll put all of their links in the description box. So, time for my random ramblings. Um, did you know that I actually chose this uh, thumbnail picture? Because it's October, so it's like Halloween at the end, so I thought this would be a nice kind of ghosty monster kind of picture. Yeah, uh, if you're wondering, most of the uh, screenshots on uh, I use as background for these shout out videos are all either love from Love Nikki, Shining Nikki, or Tears of Themis game apps. Um, they got some good backgrounds on some of those, you know, like, hence me using them. Though some might be some pictures I took, or like, in very early shout videos, or just something or other. Anyway, that, that's, that's that section of Rambling Down. Um, oh, did you know that, uh, let's see, since, um, the new Harry Potter Book 3 illustrated Mina Lima um, like, collection, you, you know what I'm saying. Well, that one comes out on, well, officially releases on the 3rd of October, and surprisingly, I actually got mine yesterday, which was the 30th of September, so I already recorded that, because I wanted to, you know, look through it and stuff. So that w uh, will be, um, I guess... <laughs> I'll do a double upload on Wednesday, because that's like my Hogwarts Legacy gaming day for now. And uh, I'll put it on in the afternoon, because I like spacing it out. So like, since supposedly Hogwarts Legacy gameplay part 28 will be uploaded at 9, if I actually remember to play, because I haven't played it yet, so I'm going to play some today. And then up upload and edit stuff. Anyway, um, so like, maybe upload that at like 1 p.m. my time, which 
GMT. Um, yeah, so we look forward to that. I'll be on the 4th of October, I believe, so it'll be one day after. But anyway, um, what next? Ah, the, the general, uh, I have loads of stuff I want to get rid of. Please go visit my eBay, which is, the handle is on the screenshot, but the link is in the description box below. And that, I believe, is under... <clears throat> it's under my um, buy section. So eBay is the first one. And well, I do have the Teespring Redbubble and Coffee up there too. I haven't really done much with those. But I do have loads of referral links if you're interested. So like from Instant Gaming, So Kawaii Box, Nihon Box. Which I think Nihon Box is gearing up to release their hundredth box or something. And then uh, my Pop in a Box referral link. I'll have to recheck that one. Um, all things vinyl for 5% off. And then um, I would, which is I want one of those.com. Uh, Melg Molds, you got a 10% off coupon code as well as the links. So I don't know if you can stack them or not. Uh, J Diction one with a 10% off coupon and referral link. A Stationary Island with a 10% off coupon and a 5% off referral link. Spellbinders, 10% off their first order of 50 plus dollars. Creative Fabrica, Altenew, $5 off coupon after your order. Which is kind of weird, it's after the order. But anyway, um, Arteza, which is a five pounds off the first order of 60 plus pounds. And a Rocket Noodles Pin Shop, uh, $5 off coupon if you use my referral link. So yes. That is just the main playlists. I actually did add one, surprisingly. And that is crafty stuff, which won't, those videos won't actually be up until I'd say like some of November and December. I don't know if I'll squeeze any of the November videos into October because to lay into rearrange because basically mostly all the videos, surprisingly, bar from like two, are all Mother's issue related. I wonder how that happened. <laughs> so maybe I'll uh well, I already uploaded and scheduled all of them, so I don't really want to fiddle around with it because then I have to remember where things go, so I might just pop some in on a Saturday, maybe? Or one video after the gameplay video on Wednesday? No idea, but currently it's mainly those of those who she in October for somehow. I have no idea how. But like, the last part 7 of the Moto Sushi Trading Card Series 2 opening is on the 2nd, which then will be the end of that series, because I don't think I'll be getting any more. Um, pin set, then the goodies box, parts, uh, box number 6, part 1 and 2. That was the big box. Um, then this one, Glance of Wonder, Birdman pin from Murmur Pins, that's gonna be on the 16th, and that's the only one pin that's not Mother Hush related. Then there's a, uh, I found we bought a shelf video. I'll need to buy more, actually. <laughs> um, then I have a scale figure from Alien, which looks awesome, but I had to put it on my filing cabinet and not on 
the shelf that I wanted because, you know, it's too big. <laughs> I mean, it's a one-eighth scale figure, so that, that's big. That's my, that's the biggest figure I own, actually, I think. It's the only scale figure I own, anyway. Um, let's see. Then there's Mother's Yoshi Goodies box number seven, and another Murmur Pins Mother's Yoshi pin. So there's, there's a, a lot of... <laughs> Yeah, and it's obviously the Wednesdays is Hogwarts Legacy Gameplay Part 28 to Part 31, if I remember to play. But luckily, I limited myself for around 30 minutes per gameplay um, length, so I'll be able to make more videos as opposed to an hour per video. And I'll probably sparsely edit that either on the PS5 because I don't have a bigger USB memory card, bigger than 4 gig at the moment. So I'd have to speed some bits up so I can fit fit it on my memory card. <laughs> um then I might put it through the editor on here, which is either, let's see, I use HitFilm and Microsoft ClipChamp. I use both interchangeably or so, and that is to cut down the video file length, well, size of the video file, so I can upload faster because it's very slow sometimes. Very slow. And let's see. As I mentioned before in November, there's actually quite a few crafty related videos, which I'm excited to show you. They're mainly crafty hauls. Some of them, like the first one, does show me kind of making ish something. Not really fully, but you know. And there's, like, on the 3rd and 6th of November. And then there's a 20th and 15th November. Though, the 15th will be a two-day, two-video day, because two it's a Wednesday, so gameplay part 34, and then the other one in the afternoon. Then there is uh, day 24 with another whole video. So uh, that's that's basically, you know, thing. And then in December there's, let's see, uh, something I bought off a friend on, a new friend on Discord, which is a Mother's Juice art book. Then there's the Kickstarter rewards, more group order things that came in. Which, constantly enough, both is Motazushi. <laughs> the Kickstarter award was a uh, washi tape that's not related to that. And then, let's see, there is an opening video of my Spellbinders Platinum die cutting machine. Um, then I actually haven't opened it yet. But I do have the Spellbinder Glimmer Hot Fall Machine system. I need to open because I finally opened the other one. So now I can open this one. But I've got until December, so I've got time. And I do want to make something with it soon, though. And I think I've given you enough spoilers for now. Just, I don't think there's anything else. Um. If you want to leave a comment below on this video or any video, I shall automatically put you into the uh, list for next Sunday's uh, shout out Sunday number 90. Um, so if you want me to shout you out, comment anything, even if it's just say hi, I'll put you up there, comment on the video, or whatever would be like, you know, nice see that you're watching or interested or whatever, I don't know. But I think that is it. So I've been rambling for like 12 minutes. 
So thank you for watching, like stuff more. Really don't watch notifications. Oh, and please do check out my eBay because I really want to get rid of loads of things because the my used to sell box is taking up room and I need that room for a shelf, technically. <laughs> um, over and out.